In this video we share Our Lady as Protectress of the Ukraine. Few realize how many times the Blessed Mother has appeared in Ukraine, and how many assorted miracles have been reported there. Our Lady is considered Protectress of Ukraine, and is prayed to as part of the formal Ukrainian Catholic Eastern Rite Liturgy. No nation is more Marian than the Ukraine. And no nation has been more persecuted and long-suffering than they have. In fact, it was way back in 1840 that a miraculous well was damaged by invaders at a village east of Lviv called Rushil. There are miraculous icons at places like Pochev that date back centuries earlier. The Blessed Mother depicted on the icon there helped to heal Philip, the brother of a prominent, wealthy woman named Hannah Hoiska, from blindness. Later, the Virgin or Theotokos of Pochev, or Pokhev, acquired a reputation as a miracle-working icon. The feast day for Our Lady of Pochev is marked by Ukrainian Orthodox communities on August 5, as distinct from Russian Orthodox, who report to the Kremlin. It is a place as powerful as it is mysterious. In 1914, on the cusp of World War I, Our Lady appeared to 22 Ukrainian Catholic peasants at Russia, sadly informing them that they faced 80 years of war, famine, and persecution, which certainly came true as communists led by Russia decimated the nation, and caused literally millions to die of starvation. Christianity was likewise all but obliterated in the nation, which became part of the Soviet Union. Great suffering was endured by Catholics and religious of all stripes, with many executed or imprisoned for decades in the horrid Russian gulags. On April 26, 1987, as freedom was about to return, the Blessed Virgin Mary arrived again in Russia, dressed in black on a day that was the exact one-year anniversary of the nuclear disaster at Chernobyl. Apparitions there were seen by young 12-year-old Maria Kizin but then night after night above the small church by thousands. This was very telling, for the name Chernobyl means wormwood, a bitter black juice herb that recalls the book of Revelation, chapter 8, verses 10 to 11. The third angel blew his trumpet, and a great star fell from heaven, blazing like a torch, and it fell on a third of the rivers and on the springs of water. The name of the star is Wormwood. A third of the waters became Wormwood, and many died from the water, because it was made bitter. The date of the first Hershey apparition thus was a warning of an event that could contaminate the Earth's waters, as might occur with radiation. The history rings home in recent days, as Russia once more aggressively moves into Ukraine to subsume it as was done under Soviet Russia. When communism fell in the Soviet republics, the Virgin Mary began to appear at churches that had been damaged, destroyed, or turned into warehouses, museums, or worse by the Soviet Russians. In some cases the Virgin appeared with child, in a massive glow encompassing the church. At Bukak, where manifestations of the Virgin Mary had occurred at the end of both world wars, she was seen with the infant Christ in an illumination above Trinity Orthodox Church. There had been strange pink and blue clouds above Trinity, other phenomena, such as smaller ephemeral images, manifested through town. This is a nation where cars were rare at the time, many still used cart and horse, there were no telephones in any home and livestock were brought into extra rooms during the bitter cold nights. The 1950s also were when the Blessed Virgin Mary appeared in a major way at Sion, another place famous for Marian miracles. The date was December 20, 1953. The vision took place in a nearby village called Dubovitsya. In a vision during Mass, a woman named Hanya saw the hill of Sion and a spot where there had been small wells of clear water. Hanya saw it all vividly, even though she had never visited the hill. As the vision continued, the Virgin began to speak to the woman. My daughter, my daughter, my daughter, you see what a fullness of grace I possess. But I have no one to give my graces to, for there are so many daughters and sons that have turned away from me. I wanted to obtain a great forgiveness for poor sinners. Disaster is upon you as in the times of Noah. 
not by flood, but by fire will the destruction come. An immense flood of fire shall destroy nations for sinning before God. Since the beginning of the world, there's never been such a fall as there is today. This is the kingdom of Satan. A thrushu, Ukrainian mystic Joseph Terralia, said he heard the Blessed Virgin Mary issue a warning on fire. He asserted that when the apparition looked into the future, she said, I see fire. The villages are burning. Water is burning. The very air is on fire. Everything is in flames. If people do not convert to Christ, there will be war. There shall be a great conflagration. Thank you for supporting my channel. God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.